In the grand theater of our lives, we play two distinct characters, the everyday self and the higher self. Imagine them like two actors on stage, each with a unique role to play in the unfolding drama of our existence. The everyday self, often called the ego, is the character we most readily identify with. It's the voice inside our heads that narrates our daily experiences, offers opinions, and frequently chimes in with its two cents on just about everything. It's the part of us that feels fear, desires, and occasionally falls victim to doubt and uncertainty. In contrast, the higher self is like the wise director behind the scenes, orchestrating the play of our lives with a perspective that transcends the limitations of time and space. It's the part of us that remains eternally connected to the divine, possessing a deep well of wisdom and insight that it seeks to impart to us. The higher self is often compared to a lighthouse, a steady beacon of light and guidance in the sometimes stormy seas of our existence. It offers us a path to navigate through life's challenges, drawing upon a wellspring of wisdom, love, and truth. Yet, in the hustle and bustle of our daily lives, the guidance of the higher self can often go unnoticed. The clamor of our thoughts, the distractions of the external world, and the demands of our responsibilities can drown out its subtle whispers. Imagine the higher self as a radio station, broadcasting its wisdom and guidance, while the noise of our everyday thoughts and the world around us often interfere with the clarity of its signal. It's like trying to listen to a favorite song on the radio, only to be interrupted by static and interference. To truly benefit from the wisdom of the higher self, we must learn to distinguish its voice from the cacophony of our own minds and the external world. Otherwise, we risk missing out on the profound insights and direction it offers. Aligning with the higher self is not merely about seeking its guidance in times of need. It's a continuous process of attuning our thoughts emotions and actions to its wisdom. Just as a ship's captain relies on the lighthouse to chart a safe course, we too can navigate the complexities of life by aligning with our higher selves. However, this alignment requires more than just a fleeting connection. It demands a deep commitment to self-awareness, self-love, and self-respect. It's a journey of consciously choosing thoughts and actions that resonate with the higher self's truth and compassion. One of the primary challenges we face in aligning with our higher selves is the relentless chatter of our own minds. Our thoughts, like a never-ending stream, can often become a barrier to receiving the clear guidance of our higher selves. Think of it as trying to have a deep conversation in a crowded and noisy room. The words may be spoken, but they get lost in the commotion. To truly hear the wisdom of our higher selves, we must learn to quiet the mental noise. This process of inner stillness doesn't entail suppressing our thoughts or denying their existence. Instead, it involves cultivating a state of mindful awareness where we can observe our thoughts without becoming entangled in them. This is a pivotal practice that opens the doorway to higher consciousness and allows the insights of the higher self to shine through. The higher self, unlike our everyday thoughts that often dwell in the past or worry about the future, exists purely in the present moment. It's free from the regrets of yesterday and the anxieties of tomorrow. Imagine it as a timeless observer, always rooted in the now. This quality of the higher self underscores the profound importance of being fully present in our lives. When we are consumed by regrets or worries, we lose touch with the deeper truths and possibilities of the present moment. We miss out on the richness of life as it unfolds before us. To align with the higher self, we must make a conscious effort to be more aware and observant of the here and now. This doesn't mean we ignore the lessons of the past or the responsibilities of the future. It means we approach life with a mindset that cherishes the present, recognizing it as the only moment where true living occurs. Focusing on the present moment is not just a philosophical concept. It's a practical tool for harmonizing with the higher self. When we become more present, we naturally remove the distractions and mental clutter that often obscure the voice of our inner wisdom. In the words of Eckhart Tolle, realize deeply that the present moment is all you have. Make the now the primary focus of your life. By embracing the now, we create a space for the higher self to communicate its insights and guidance with clarity. 
This practice of presence is not about achieving a static state of mind, but rather about continuously returning to the here and now, even in the midst of life's challenges and busyness. It's an ongoing dance of awareness that allows us to access the timeless wisdom of the higher self in the ever-changing flow of life. Acceptance is a powerful key to unlocking the guidance and wisdom of the higher self. Our minds have a natural tendency to judge and label our experiences as either good or bad, desirable or undesirable. This pattern of judgment often clouds our perception and creates inner resistance. However, the higher self operates from a perspective of unconditional love and acceptance. It sees each moment as a valuable part of our journey, regardless of how we may label it. When we learn to accept each moment without judgment, we open ourselves to the deeper truths and insights that the higher self offers. As we release the need to control or resist what is, we create a space for the higher self to guide us with its clarity and compassion. To practice acceptance, Start by observing your inner dialogue when faced with a challenging situation. Notice any thoughts of resistance, judgment, or blame that arise. Instead of getting caught up in these reactive patterns, take a step back and remind yourself that this moment, with all its imperfections, is an essential part of your growth and learning. Embrace it with an open heart and a willingness to see beyond the surface. As you cultivate this attitude of acceptance, you'll find that the voice of the higher self becomes more pronounced, offering you profound insights and a deeper connection to your true nature. In the grand journey of life, every experience, whether joyful or challenging, serves a purpose. The higher self, with its infinite wisdom, recognizes that each moment is a stepping stone on the path of our evolution and self-discovery. It encourages us to embrace life in its totality, to fully engage in the dance of existence, not as passive spectators, but as active participants. However, our minds, conditioned by societal norms and personal fears, often resist this call to wholehearted living. We may find ourselves wishing for a more comfortable life, free of obstacles and pain. Yet, the higher self gently reminds us that it is precisely in the face of challenges that we have the most to gain. It is through our struggles that we discover our strengths, our resilience, and our capacity for growth. As the saying goes, smooth seas do not make skillful sailors. The higher self invites us to shift our perspective, to see every experience as a valuable chapter in the story of our lives, rather than labeling events as good or bad. We can recognize them as integral parts of our personal and spiritual development. Acceptance of reality, especially in challenging times, is a cornerstone of aligning with the higher self. When we resist or deny the present moment, whether due to physical pain, emotional turmoil, or disillusionment, we create inner friction, a resistance that separates us from the flow of life. This resistance is often born from the ego's desire for control and its aversion to anything that threatens its sense of security or identity. Yet, the higher self, with its expansive perspective, invites us to embrace reality as it is, to surrender our need for control, and to trust in the inherent wisdom of the universe. This doesn't mean we passively accept injustice or cruelty. It means that we acknowledge the truth of our circumstances without adding unnecessary layers of mental suffering. As we learn to accept the reality of our experiences, we release the burden of inner conflict, and we open ourselves to the guidance and wisdom of the higher self. Ultimately, this practice of acceptance leads to a profound inner peace, even in the midst of life storms. In the vast tapestry of existence, our journey is not merely a physical one, but a profound spiritual odyssey. We are here, in this physical form, to grow, to evolve, and to discover the deepest truths of our being. Each day, each moment offers us an opportunity to expand our consciousness and to align more closely with the wisdom of our higher selves. However, to embark on this conscious path of spiritual growth, we must first recognize the guidance of the higher self amidst the daily rhythms of life. Our higher selves communicate with us in myriad ways, through intuition, synchronicities, and inner knowing. They offer us gentle nudges in the right direction, whispering insights that often go unnoticed in the hustle and bustle of our minds. Becoming aware of this subtle communication is a journey in itself, 
one that requires mindfulness, self-reflection, and an openness to the mysteries of existence. One of the most profound shifts we can make on our journey of spiritual growth is to change our perception of life itself. When we view life through the lens of the ego, we often see it as a series of random events, a collection of moments strung together with no inherent meaning or purpose. This perspective can lead to feelings of disconnection, confusion, and a sense of aimlessness. However, the higher self invites us to see life as a deliberate and sacred journey, a path of self-discovery and spiritual awakening. From this vantage point, every experience, no matter how mundane or challenging, becomes a stepping stone on the path of our evolution. Even the most difficult moments when viewed through the lens of the higher self can be seen as opportunities for growth, learning and self-realization. The higher self, as a concept, is deeply rooted in the understanding that each of us possesses an inner source of wisdom, love, and guidance. It is the essence of our being, our truest and most authentic self. However, in the busyness and noise of everyday life, it's easy to lose touch with this higher aspect of ourselves. We become entangled in the web of our thoughts, emotions, and external distractions, often forgetting the profound well of wisdom that resides within. Yet, the higher self is always there, patiently waiting for us to re-establish our connection. It is the part of us that remains eternally connected to the divine, to the universal intelligence that orchestrates the cosmos. It is the voice of intuition, the source of inner peace, and the wellspring of unconditional love. To align with the higher self is to recognize that it is not something separate from us, but an integral part of our being. It is our true nature, the aspect of us that transcends the limitations of the ego and the physical world. This recognition is not merely intellectual, but experiential. It requires a deep inner knowing that goes beyond words. When we align with the higher self, we begin to see the world through its eyes. We perceive the underlying unity of all things, the interconnectedness of life. This shift in perception brings a sense of harmony and peace, both within ourselves and in our external reality. The decisions we make, the actions we take, and the relationships we cultivate all reflect this alignment with the higher self. Life begins to flow with greater ease, and we find ourselves more in tune with the natural rhythms of existence. Expanded consciousness is a term that encapsulates the idea of broadening our awareness beyond the narrow confines of the ego. It is the process of awakening to the deeper truths of our existence and recognizing the interconnectedness of all life. The guidance of the higher self becomes more accessible as we expand our consciousness. This expansion is not merely about accumulating knowledge or information, but about deepening our understanding of the fundamental principles that govern the universe. It involves transcending the limitations of the ego's perspective and embracing a more holistic and inclusive worldview. Practices such as meditation, mindfulness, and self-inquiry are powerful tools for expanding consciousness. They help us to quiet the mind, cultivate inner stillness, and tap into the intuitive wisdom of the higher self. With a more expanded consciousness, we become more attuned to the subtle nuances of life. We recognize the signs and synchronicities that the universe presents to us, guiding us along our unique paths. This heightened awareness allows us to make decisions that are in alignment with our higher purpose and to navigate the complexities of life with greater clarity and insight. Affirmations are positive statements that we can use to shift our thoughts and beliefs from the limited perspective of the ego to the expansive insights of the higher self. They are a powerful tool for reprogramming the subconscious mind and aligning our inner dialogue with the truth of our being. When we repeat affirmations regularly, they become ingrained in our consciousness, influencing how we perceive ourselves and the world around us. For example, if you find yourself plagued by self-doubt, you might create an affirmation such as I trust in the wisdom of my higher self. By repeating this affirmation, you remind yourself that the guidance and wisdom you seek are already within you. Over time, this practice can help to dissolve the patterns of self-doubt and fear that may have held you back. It's important to choose affirmations that resonate with your authentic self and to use them consistently. The more you affirm your connection to the higher self, 
the more you will find yourself naturally aligning with its insights and guidance. Consistency is the cornerstone of any spiritual practice. Whether it's meditation, mindfulness, or the use of affirmations, the key to bridging the gap to the higher self is to engage in these practices regularly and with dedication. The higher self is always available to us, but it can be elusive if we only seek it sporadically. By establishing a consistent routine, you create a container for the wisdom of the higher self to flow into your life. Consistency also helps to anchor the insights and guidance you receive. It's one thing to have a profound spiritual experience in a moment of inspiration. It's another to integrate that experience into your daily life. By consistently engaging with practices that connect you to the higher self, you reinforce the pathways of communication between your everyday self and your higher self. Over time, this leads to a more harmonious and balanced way of being, where the guidance of the higher self becomes an ever-present companion on your journey. The essence of the higher self is unity. It is the part of us that recognizes the interconnectedness of all things. When we align with the higher self, we begin to see the world through the lens of unity. We recognize that the separations and divisions we perceive are often illusions created by the ego. Decisions made in alignment with the higher self reflect this understanding of unity. They are not based on fear, competition, or the desire for control, but on a deep sense of interconnectedness and harmony with all of life. As a result, life begins to flow with greater ease. Challenges that once seemed insurmountable become opportunities for growth and learning. The higher self guides us to make decisions that are not only in our best interest, but also in the best interest of the collective. When we are aligned with the higher self, we become co-creators in the grand symphony of existence. Life becomes a dance of co-creation where we play our part, and the universe responds in kind supporting our aligned decisions and intentions. We begin to notice synchronicities, opportunities, and serendipitous events that seem to align perfectly with our path. This is the universe at work, conspiring to help us fulfill our higher purpose. However, this dance of co-creation requires our active participation. We must be willing to listen to the guidance of the higher self and to take inspired action. When we do, we find that the universe meets us halfway offering its support and blessings.